Maddie, I'm gonna tell you right here and now in front of everyone, I don't think you're doing a solo at Nationals. You're a Jimmy Kimmel today, you're a Jimmy Kimmel all day tomorrow. That gives us one day to do a solo before Nationals. I would love to do a solo. I don't care if I have to learn in one day. She doesn't have to be there till two tomorrow. I don't want to throw you out on that stage not being your best, Maddie. You are not doing a solo at Nationals. I just want a solo really bad. And even though I have other things that I have to do in LA, I still want to be able to compete as a soloist. I guarantee Abby has something up her sleeve for Maddie for Nationals. I'm assuming she's doing a solo at Nationals. We all assumed she was doing one at Nationals because yesterday was the first time that we heard that she wasn't doing a solo when Abby said it at Pyramid. But when we came in today, the first dance taught was Maddie solo. Maddie had a super secret private and learned the solo on her own before the rest of the girls came in. But she told all of us Maddie is not doing a solo. Right. What are the games Abby's playing? You know, if I have learned anything this competition season, it's expect Maddie to dance an unexpected dance. There is no way that Abby is not going to let Maddie dance a solo at nationals, ever. The whole whatever me media frenzy that's going to happen, it's a distraction. Absolutely. Absolutely. Abby's job is to teach dance and to make sure the kids are prepared for national. She, this is not the time to be focused on media and meeting people. Because if our kids we need to be lose. focused on dancing and being prepared. Oh my God, please make sure that that attitude is an attitude. It's nationals week and Abby is clearly not in our game. She's looking at new studios. Another great thing about this location is you're right between Santa Monica and Brentwood on one side and Beverly Hills on the other. She's leaving early to watch Maddie at Jimmy Kimmel. All right. OK, I'm looking forward to seeing you, sir. She's not even at the studio for rehearsals. Like, did she just use Nationals as an excuse to get out here and kind of work on all for other things? Because that's what it feels like to us. OK, that has to be a split. I really had high hopes for this number, but it's obvious that she's not been given a solo that shows off all of her talent. Do you like Chloe? No. Not at all? No. It's not Chloe at all. What's up? Was there a problem with? You You see the dance. You see that that's not Chloe's style. Everybody... I think she looks great. She worked on it. The whole deal about this dance was that it had to be good choreography, and it's not. You guys are her. You really are. There was one like thing that I changed, but the whole timing thing, I don't know what she's worked up about. OK. There's nothing to worry about. Again, Abby is missing in action. She hasn't spent any time with the soloist. Chloe, Kendall, and Cameron have only gotten a few minutes to learn their solos. At this rate, who knows who's going to win nationals? Abby, she'll take a look at the solos, decide they're not good enough, and throw Maddie in at the last minute. I would put nothing past her by doing that. I don't understand. Now, so is Maddie doing a solo? In Pyramid, she said Maddie is not having a solo. So yeah, where water, did that I come have, from? I have no idea. Did you think all along? I know yeah, I have a because solo. You and, I no, because you and Maddie were both like, okay. She didn't look upset that she was not getting or a solo. Or question why. Well, it Tell was a me, little too neatly packaged of a response okay if, if you were blindsided if you weren't. Oh, no, I, I disagree. No way. It just really messed up because everyone has now had more than one turn to have a solo at Nationals. And my kid has yet to have one. Abby, are there any other soloists? Well, Maddie started a solo. Maddie, do you want to do a solo? Yes. It's good that they're doing a solo, and I'm happy for them, but I want to do a solo, too. In Pyramid, Abby specifically said, Maddie's busy going to Jimmy Kimmel. She does not have a solo at Nationals. I don't know what to think. Well, I think it should be that way, that the three girls get the solo. No, I just want, you know, a chance for the other girls. Oh. Melissa, I think you're backpedaling a little bit. I just remember when you were more concerned with her future than your friendships and how everybody else felt. I thought there were only three solos. But I think the issue, I thought there were only three solos to be given. I just have a lot to think about. Mackenzie, up, up, down, up, up, down, down, I gave it to you. You know what?
up, Maddie? Why don't you go in the other room and work on your solo? I need a sure thing to count on for competition. These kids, they're struggling with these routines. I might have to really take the mothers off and stick Maddie in the competition. Can we practice the group dance? I was, you know, the group dance first. Simple question. For a minute and 45 seconds, Nia and Mackenzie have choreography with that chair. So until those two get their act together, Maddie should go do something else. Melissa says nothing. The group dance is the most important dance. Shame on Melissa for not speaking up and saying that's wrong. Maddie wasn't given a solo at, at Pyramid. Now there's this super secret solo. I guess at this point, you're OK with Maddie doing a solo, because you didn't speak up. If you really aren't going to pull it, just say, I'm right. not going to pull Either it, one. I'm going to own it. Either you one. need to do something. I, I, at this point, I'm not. Oh, my god. Oh, my god. You said, oh, I'm glad my friends are finally getting a chance. You said that. Those were your words. You just made it perfectly clear where we all stand. Your decision not to say anything to Abby doesn't surprise me. It that makes me decision. sad. Oh, my god. I don't know what planet I'm on. And that's what bothers me. That would have been a perfect opportunity. OK. I'm going to go talk to Abby. You need to be so high in your one hand and handstand that your foot is like straight, your leg comes in. I really can give what anybody tells me to do, because I'm my own person. And I'm standing up for myself. I'm not letting people walk all over me anymore. I'm just sick and tired of all the I want to just take my kids and go to nationals. I'm so over this. We're at Intensity National Dance Competition. This is for all the marbles. Kathy's here, which is just like a knife in my side. I think they're doing chandelier. Kendall said she heard the music walking by their door. In the program book, it says they're doing chandelier. Oh my god, I'm going to get sick to my stomach. I'm thinking very strongly about taking one of the solos away and entering Maddie. Do you want to do the dance with Fred? Do you want to do the CN number and shove it all in their faces? and have the place go crazy. What do you want to do? It's up to you. No, it's not up to me. I'm giving you the right to choose what you want. I'll have to say no. I can't believe that Maddie said she didn't want to perform at nationals. I think it's time she concentrate more on her dancing and less on her friends. So Maddie's not dancing. You're not putting her in. You have faith in these girls. She said not to do that. She yeah, like of course. Would never I would never do it. Melissa left that decision up to Maddie. Why couldn't Melissa make that decision? She couldn't bring herself to do the right thing. For me, congratulating Miss Kendall with Act Number 28, My Name and Lights, from the Abbey Lee Dance Company. Miss Cameron with Act Number 26, This is the Start, from the Abbey Lee Dance Company. Join me congratulating Miss Chloe with Act Number 29, Soaring, from the Abbey Lee Dance Company. Not one of our solos was the overall high score winner. Not one was first place. That is unheard of for the Abbey Lee Dance Company. All I know is that when Maddie goes out to perform, she wins.